What's up guys, welcome to my channel, Escape to Explorer Videos. This video is a compilation of the two times that I went on board the Queen Mary in Long Beach, California. I had no idea that I would ever make a YouTube video about it, but being that the Queen Mary filed for bankruptcy protection a while ago, and being that it's still temporarily closed to the public, I just had to make it. Hopefully the Queen Mary will open again to the public eventually. I mean, it has a lot of history. It just can't be scrapped off. Someone has to save the Queen. So the footage that I took of the Queen Mary was shot about two years ago. So the only physical thing that I got out of the Queen Mary was this ticket here. Here, let me zoom in. And I got this to board the Queen Mary. I kind of wish now that I would have at least bought a shirt or a cup as a souvenir. Also, it would have been really cool to stay on board the Queen Mary overnight. I remember the last time I was there, some guests dressed up in 1930s style clothing. It felt like I was in that era for a brief moment. Anyways, let's start the video. All right, the Queen Mary in Long Beach, California. This beautiful ship. Look at that. Magnificent. So this was a uh, pretty warm day. It was a Christmas. There you can see that, that white dome. That's where the uh, Hauer Hughes spruce goose was stored. But it's not there anymore. It was an airplane. So this is the uh, like the hall here, the the top of the uh, the deck, and right here, you have like um, like gift uh, gift shops where you can buy some souvenirs. Yeah, so. It's pretty nice inside. It's Christmas. And th those those two right there, they're they're, they're my parents. So. And um yeah, Christmas time. I think so. That's yeah, me right? talking. <laughs> yeah, so my mom had the um her iPad with her. She was like recording and everything too. Right. Oh yeah, so about the Queen Mary how it ended up in Long Beach. So, I guess the people who, who were selling the ship because it was no longer profitable. You know, the Queen Mary, it was built by, by the UK. And, um, so there was this bid for it that, when it was selling, and, um, Long Beach won. And there's stories, I think you can, I think you can Google this online, that the, uh, New York, New York lost the bid. So imagine if New York had won, the Queen Mary would have been over there instead of Long Beach, California. Isn't that crazy? So right here, this is the, uh, what's it called? The, um, this is like where all the liquor is. <laughs> and okay, so I just, yeah, I just went, I didn't record that much of it. So right here, what you're looking at is the first class dining hall or the lounge. So this is where the, where the first class, all the passengers of the first class have their, um, have their activities, you know, like dancing, lounging, and all that stuff here. And this spot is also famous for being featured in the aviator. It was a lot of the, some of the scenes were filmed in this room right here. And also, but I'm not really sure, I tried to, I tried to look this up online, but I couldn't find anything. But if you guys seen that video from the weekend on YouTube, it's a music video. It's called, um, Blinding Lights or something. I'm not really sure, but it's by the weekend. It's a song and there's like, 
I could, I swear to God, there's like a scene. It looks like if, like it was some of the scenes were filmed in this room right here. So that's me just recording like myself and you know, because I wasn't really recording myself. I was just like filming the the mirror because it had this really like uh, cool tinted color to it. So what we're doing right now, right here in the Queen Mary is we um we bought this uh ticket like the three of us i mean the four of us we bought a ticket to have a a, a tour guide just show us around the ship and uh it's not it's not accessible by like just you know like anyone um you actually need like a tour guide to um for him to unlock the um the rooms here so So what you saw there was a, a view of Long Beach, downtown Long Beach. So he was playing there, Jesus Joy Man Society by Fox. And that was me playing. My mom recorded that clip right there on her iPad vertically and I was playing a little bit of Franz Liszt Un Suspiro but uh you know I was like we're like okay we have to go because our tour guide was was leaving so we have we had to follow him so this room right here is pretty special so this room is on the back of the Queen Mary it's like right on the top of the deck and this room is preserved only was was preserved only for for the royalty family. No one else could go inside of it, even if the royalty family wasn't cruising or anything like that. Okay, so our tour guide here unlocked the door. So this right here is the second class lounging area. It's not so, it's not as nice as the first class lounging area. But uh, yeah, that's how it was back then. So a little bit, a little history about this ship. It, it was, uh, it sailed off in 19... 36 that was his first uh, voyage and uh, it's just it did about 1001 uh, trips across the Atlantic Ocean before it was retired and brought here to Long Beach California to my knowledge right now it's in better condition than pretty much ever been yeah they've had they put a lot of money into restoration lately I think they had to make some I just thought that looked kind of cool. It, it kind of looked like 3D. Okay, so this is the front of the ship here. And this is like the shower, the bathroom of the captain. So right here you have the quarters of the, you know, the captain and his, uh, what's it called? The, 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 the other yeah. people who, who, um, That's pretty neat. who control the ship you know, sail the ship. So this is, it's okay, so this is so that's like, the like right two there. years ago. This was not taken with my parents. I mean, I, I didn't go with them at this time. So this is a cutout of a ship here. I think this, this ship right here might have been the Titanic or it might have been the Carpathia or the Britannic. But I'm pretty sure this was a cutout of the the was the, the uh, Titanic, where they have the coal or what? The boat? Yeah. And they have they have these oh. on the ship, and you know people can take a really close look at them, right and you will see some stuff like that. See that? Damn. Like chairs. I'm, that that was the first class awesome. right there on top. So it was pretty neat. Very interesting. Yeah. 
Oh, this is the back, because that's the rudder. Yeah. Okay, so this room here kind of, I don't know, it was so weird. It, it's, it had a smell of church, like it smells like a really old room or something. I don't know. And that is the old piano there. It's a picture that I took. All right. So this was off the tour. I mean, anyone can go in here and um, just like look. So this is the uh, the Winston Churchill uh, Museum, I think. So there's just like a bunch of rooms and it's like, there's just, they're like trying to portray how, the times of how it was back then. So, very interesting stuff. Aside from this, they also had like, uh, I kind of, I kind of forgot to record this one room that that our guide, tour guide took us. It was called the uh, cigarette room, or, or no, not the cigarette room. It was called the uh, cigar room, where like the really wealthy people um, lounged in, and that was in the first class. I didn't record any video of that, and. I kind of regret not doing that, but oh well. So this ship was used during World War II, so that's why you have like a lot of uh, World War II stuff here. And it was, I think it was called, they, they painted the ship gray, and I think it might have been called, they nicknamed it the gray ship or something, I'm not really sure. That's cool. The gas mask. Because of that, all that stuff. Um, now, like they had a, a, they came up with like haunted haunted tours, or like you can like maybe see a spirit or something. And um, so that was one of the tours that that the, the Queen Mary had, and hopefully. Um, They'll bring it back again if it reopens again to the public. But I was saying that so they have you have the self-guided tour, not the self-guided tour, um, the gu the guided tour it, uh, about the history of the Queen Mary, which t takes you through the rooms, and then you have the haunted tour, uh, and then you have the princess. Uh, what was her name? The one who got killed in a car accident. Oh yeah, they also have a Princess Diana tour in here as well. And you know, they would just, uh, that was like in the upper deck and they would just um, show like her dresses. I think they might have had, legitimately had some of her dresses in there. So that was the Princess Diana tour. And they also had the ham room and that one I showed you guys like in a one and a half minute minute video. So I was interestingly I was the only person down here when I was filming all of all, all of this right here. For the uh, the Winston Churchill um, exhibit, there was no one else down here. I was the only one, so that was pretty crazy. Oh, look at that! That looks like a Browning machine gun. It's a fifty cal. And yeah, uh, I guess that's all there is to say about this this tour here. That chicken. Okay, so this right here, they're, they're, um, this they're was part of, of the haunted tour, yeah, and they show like a lot more graphic yeah. stuff, like you know, like uh, okay. fake stuff. Of course, it wasn't real. 
but like severed heads and animal body parts and all that stuff. I didn't want to show that in here, but this was the haunted tour that they have here. It was pretty dark. Belong to our Curacao story because the Queen Mary was 20 times the size of Curacao. Most of the soldiers that grew on board didn't even realize they had hit something until they saw the flaming wreckage on either side of them. The only damage. This is the uh, engine room. It was really big inside here. They're a lot more bigger than this. There's a lot more stuff to see. I really didn't film a lot of this, but yeah. And that wraps up my video. Anyways, thanks for watching if you made it this far. Consider subscribing to my channel if you like the type of content that I make. I'm trying to get 100 subscribers. See you guys on the next video. Bye.